Hey, my name's Steve Caballero, and my favorite skateboarder, huh, that's a tough one. Um, I've had many favorite skateboarders over the years. I would have to say my very, very first favorite skateboarder was Eddie Alguera um, in the 1980s. Uh, he was kind of like the leader of inventing new tricks and stuff. He was pretty much ahead of his time uh, when it came to the progression of the sport. Um, every contest he had a new trick. Um, and he was somebody that I looked up to looking in the magazines and looking at the sequences uh, before there was ever even video exposure. Um, we had to look at magazines and sequences to see what the new tricks were and um, every contest he had some new trick and uh, he was very creative, very innovative and he's somebody that I inspired to be just like and also skate like because um, his tricks were just far and above beyond what other people were doing. The tricks that stood out to me was definitely a frontside invert. Uh, he was one of the first guys to ever kind of flip it upside down and actually do the trick, you know, versus, you know, or just a regular hand plant. Um, frontside rock and roll was another uh, pretty cool progressive trick that of the time when rock and rolls came out. And all, all, also the Algarial that he created and invented a 360 hand plant. Um, so uh, yeah, th those were just a few. Um, he was very first one for me to ever see someone do a fakie ollie um, in a pool um, and also board slides to fakie. Um, so uh, yeah, there's a handful of tricks that he invented that um, made him g gain the status of being a number one sta skater. And you know, I, I believe Tony Hawk um, also was inspired by Eddie um, because of his progressive attitude and, and what he brought to the sport. If I was to pick a favorite skater who I love watching currently is probably uh, Corey Juno. Um, just every contest that I've seen him in and everything that I've seen him do trick-wise, I mean, he just looks beautiful on a board. Um, the way he flows, the, his style, it's just so casual and but aggressive and, and gnarly at the same time. You know, it's just it's just something about skateboarding that separates other people and you know people claim that skateboarding is an art form and I, I truly believe it is and when Corey paints a picture in a pool it's beautiful you know his lines are flowing and, and they just look effortless but then again you know what he's doing is, is pretty hard um, but he just makes it look easy and makes it look fun and uh, so I have to say, currently, my favorite skateboarder today is Corey Juro. Yeah.
Bitch, you've got so much.